As Marshalltown High School students head back to the classroom, they'll notice the grass is looking a little greener on their football field. Construction on a new track and field began in April and wrapped up last week, just in time for Friday Night Lights to begin. Go, go, go. It's a project Marshalltown Superintendent Dr. Theron Schutte says is long overdue. I really feel strongly that our student athletes and uh, our students that perform in activities and things like that, they deserve the absolute best. In addition to the stadium, a storm shelter is also under construction on the property. Made possible by a $3.4 million FEMA grant, the shelter is vital to the Marshalltown community that has already endured so much in the past few years. We stood a great chance of getting the grant eventually due to the challenges we've had with a tornado in 2018 that devastated uh, much of our community and also the duration. Superintendent Schutte says the improvements are helping Marshalltown come back stronger than ever. I think it helps create a lot of pride and synergy within the community. Marshalltown's had its uh, share of challenges for sure and um, but through that we've also come together as a community. Construction on the shelter will begin in spring. Once complete, it will be able to hold more than 900 people. Meanwhile, the first home football game is in just a few weeks, and so is a ribbon cutting ceremony to celebrate all the new accomplishments. In Marshalltown, Alyssa Gomez, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's news leader. And by the way, that ribbon cutting ceremony is set to take place September 1st, one week before Marshalltown's first football game on that new field.